They said it towered above the sea, a giant made of bronze, guarding a city of warriors. But what if one of the Seven Wonders only stood for a moment before the Earth itself tore it down? Welcome to Mysterio Archives, unlocking the secrets of time. Today, we're uncovering the rise and the fall of the Colossus of Rhodes. It began after a victory. In 305 BCE, the people of Rhodes defeated an invading army against impossible odds. To celebrate, they envisioned something no one had ever dared to build a statue of the sun god Helios, larger than any structure the ancient world had seen, crafted by the sculptor chairs of Lindos. The Colossus rose piece by piece, bronze plates hammered into shape, towering walls of stone inside, its height reaching over thirty meters, as tall as the Statue of Liberty's torch. For twelve long years, the people watched their wonder climb toward the sky, until finally, Helios stood over the harbor, a symbol of freedom and triumph. But triumph never lasts forever. Just fifty-six years after it was built, the earth shook. A massive earthquake tore through roads. Walls fell. Homes collapsed. And the great colossus once, unbreakable, snapped at the knees. The giant crashed to the ground, the bronze echoing like thunder across the island. For centuries it lay broken, its shattered limbs larger than houses, a fallen god resting in the dust. And yet, even in ruin, it became more famous than it ever was. Standing tall, travelers described walking through its fingers, marveling at the craftsmanship of a civilization that dared to dream beyond limits. The Colossus might have stood for only a moment in history, but its legend has stood for over two thousand years. A wonder can fall, but its story can rise forever. This is the Mysterio Archives, unlocking the secrets of time. If you were moved by this story, subscribe, leave a like, and share this video with someone who loves history. Join our growing archive of untold stories, where every week we travel deeper into the past.